Guys, what I'm about to show you might be one of the most important things I've ever learned on YouTube now. There is this bot called Logan, where it all, the only thing he or it says is, wanna be friends. And I advise you, if any of them ask you that, do not click it. Please, it's for your safety. I'm about to explain to you, well, I'm about to show you why everything in this video. Not this one, this video. There's more than one chaotic force of nature festering its way across the world right now. The difference is, the one I'm going to be talking about today is not only far more contagious, but you're not even safe from it inside your own home. The worst part is, all you need to do to get affected by this phenomenon is to answer one simple question. Wanna, wanna be, be friends? If you follow any smaller creators, you'll have almost definitely seen this line of text in their comment section. I can without a doubt say it's the widest spread comment I've ever seen. Guys, before I go on... Wanna be friends, you're a sweaty loser, hacker. Wanna be friends, wanna be friends, or I mean, blah, 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 blah. Wanna be friends. It's everywhere. Not only me. Hang on. Crap. Hang on. But, I think it's also here. I hope not. It's definitely somewhere. Okay, probably, my friend doesn't have it, but it's good. Just keep watching, guys. Keep watching. But it's so much more malicious than it seems on the surface. At first, I thought it was an upstart YouTube channel trying to do some marketing. But it quickly dawned on me how much more sinister this situation was. Thousands of people have lost their entire channels from this one innocent comment. And it's one of the largest security breaches I've seen YouTube go through throughout my decade on the platform. Stay until the end of the video and you'll find out not only how dangerous this simple comment is and how to stay safe from it, but also how it's led to one of the fastest growing channels on the platform since Logan Paul. Speaking of Logan, that happens to be one of the many aliases this comment has been posted by, and it's also the one I've personally been plagued by. It would appear as the first two comments on every new video of mine, sometimes before they'd even gone public, so something was already suspicious. I did some investigating by asking on both my Twitter and a subreddit. The response was instantaneous, which confirmed my theory. The scale of this comment was unprecedented. I'd seen it on videos besides mine, and I wasn't the only one. To put it in perspective, if you search any words into the YouTube search bar and filter results by upload time, you're bound to find this comment on whatever you click on, no matter what it's about, no matter how many views that video currently has. So it's just a bot system that someone is using to advertise their channel, right? Well. Advertising is a bit of a stretch. The truth is unfortunately far less innocent than that. When I started investigating this, I didn't really realise how much of a can of worms it was, so I didn't know where to ask. I started on Twitter and got a few positive responses from people I knew, and then I made a post on the Out of the Loop subreddit in case it was a trend that a YouTuber had started, or it was some kind of meme or something that I wasn't aware of. I did actually get a fair bit of information out of the Out of the Loop subreddit, but unfortunately people didn't answer in the correct format. For those who don't know, when you make an answer on the Out of the Loop subreddit, you need to start it with answer colon and then the answer. And people didn't do that. So all I had was some um, notifications which were cut off. It was on the subreddit where I first found out subscribing to one of these accounts would have some kind of bad consequence. I also had confirmation that people with no channel presence whatsoever, people only getting two views on their videos, would have the comment on their videos. So it was spreading pretty fast. In fact, on one of Logan's videos, I saw someone begging for their account back. They claimed that Logan had hacked them 
and they no longer had access to their account. As for how this happened, I wish I knew. During the investigation I was carrying out, a few rumours came in that engaging with the person asking to be friends would be dangerous. At first, I thought this was only a rumour, but I went on to find some worrying evidence that it was true. In fact, even as little of a gesture as subscribing to the account could be enough to put you in danger and have you potentially lose your YouTube channel altogether. Chasing down these comments, they all James, yeah. listen to me. I'm making a video on this. This is very important. Okay. On my what YouTube channel and so many other YouTube channels, this person called Logan, if he ever asks want to be friends, don't even think about commenting back. That is like a, sp a virus. If you comment or like it, he will hack your channel I'm watching a video right now about how dangerous it is what can you come use right yes I can look at this it only shows me oh yeah the most dangerous comment on YouTube and look at this Tommy me no not him only people with up uh, with under th two views like me. It's always Wait, the first it comment. It doesn't show me, it doesn't show me, it doesn't show me. It doesn't? Yeah, it doesn't for some reason. That's weird. Is it blank? No, I, c I can't see like the other half. Is this good? Or... No, I can't. Can you maybe take a screenshot and post it to our what's called? Uh, can, you see the, can you see this at least? Yeah, I guess. All seem to lead me to the same destination, a gaming channel called Tribe. Alright, alright, so I am Tribe, and this is a proper introductory video to my channel. What's alarming about this is the scale of his growth. Here's a thought experiment for you. Imagine a new channel started making videos, and their first video was just titled, Welcome to my channel. It's one minute long, and the thumbnail just says, Please subscribe. How many views do you think- What? Hold on, hold on, hold on, be right back. Yeah, I'm gonna keep. I'm gonna keep going. So, you guys, I'm warning James right now, but I'm also gonna warn the other guys. Oh, yeah, that's it. That's it. What? Did he like it too? I don't know how many people liked it, but hang on, let me find it on this video. How many comments does this guy have? Well over a lot. But James, I beg of you to not even think about. Responding or liking him. Yeah, I'm not touching anything. Hold on. I need I need one. I need one. Do I take a piece of spirit back? Yeah, yeah. Okay, guys, I'm gonna continue with this while James comes back. Well, while James is in the bathroom. I think it would get a small handful, right? Try 96,000 in 24 hours. This would literally never happen under ordinary circumstances. Not only would they have no prior subscribers, but there's no reason to watch a video like that from a complete stranger. Creators make the mistake of making videos like that all the time, and people just do not care. Anyone who's even mildly versed in YouTube will tell you not to do this. It's not how you start a channel. Yet alone the fact that there's zero chance of it appearing in YouTube's algorithm. So things are already a bit suspicious. And it wasn't a one-off. It kept happening. The guy is decent at commentating, but not good enough to warrant this growth. It was only when he released his third video that the mystery revealed itself. I am going to help three YouTubers get to 1,000 subscribers. Of course. Now there's a reason for someone to actually watch a video like that, yet ironically, it gets the least views of all his videos. Suddenly, people start watching for real, and because of Tribe's unprecedented growth, people believe he can do it. I should mention at this point that Tribe renamed his channel back to Logan, whereas before, Logan would just lead to Tribe's channel. 
so it seems as though he keeps changing the name of his channel, probably to avoid detection. He says he knows the secrets of a YouTube algorithm, but he's incredibly vague. He keeps stringing you on, giving you little tidbits of advice, and saying that one day he'll show you how he managed to grow to the size he did. But he never does. In my last video, I promised you guys that I was going to show you a few steps and tricks that you could use to grow your own YouTube channel just like I did. In fact, he made a video giving the supposed advice he follows to get these numbers, but you check his videos and he doesn't even follow the bullshit he peddles you. Here is the format of a well-written description. He gives the most basic of basic advice which any YouTuber or person who's not even YouTubing knows to follow. He probably got these tips off a website and he's just claiming they're the way he managed to grow his channel when in reality he's doing it in a much dodgier way. If you haven't guessed by now, this f head developed one of the most advanced bots on Okay, that was a swear word, good thing he beeped it out. On YouTube's platform, just to make his channel appear as though he'd worked out the secrets of the algorithm and now he plans to string people along and create exponential figures of engagement so his channel can snowball, going from shady bots to get views to actual engagement of people wanting to know how he- He did it. Just to make his channel appear as though he'd worked out the secret to the algorithm. If you look at his first few videos, you'll see his comments are just... nothing. Things people would literally never comment especially in response to the videos he was posting. Yeah, the real way he growed his channel so large was using bots. They're all bots, but bots using real accounts. Your accounts, actually. So how did he get these accounts? Well, that brings us back to the original question. Wanna, Wanna be, be friends? friends? Somehow, this guy developed a way of hacking people's channels. So yeah. I'm back. Okay, I'm going Logan, this guy, he was actually a YouTuber. And he found a way to get bots to subscribe to him using real accounts to hack. What the f- Okay. Guys, I'm gonna keep going, even when Jim's on the call, and I'm gonna go live so he can watch it. Can you see? Hold up, I'm- You have to see it solely by having them subscribe to him. And this is incredibly alarming. All these accounts posting these fake comments are real accounts, so this plague can go unnoticed by YouTube, and his channel can thrive with nobody knowing how. This is not okay. People worked hard to make these channels unlike him, and they can lose it within seconds just by falling for a comment and subscribing to this person. It's even speculated that just responding to his comment can result in you losing your account to him. What's even more concerning is the fake comments he leaves on people's videos seem so real, yes, as they'll talk about specific situations and parts of the video. For example, he mentioned my exact subscriber count and wished me luck on getting 35,000. A couple of his comments even responded to specific things I'd said in the video before my videos had gone public, before it even had time to watch them, so I can only right, discern right. that it's using transcriptions and some access to the YouTube database in order to achieve this. It's an in Yo! Yeah. Did I comment 10 minutes ago? I only went public a minute ago? Bro, and I was on mute, crap. <laughs> But guys, Shit. bro, hang on. Before I continue, guys, I'm gonna Hello, search everybody. this guy up. Logan. Bro. Do you? Hang on, buddy. If I go to my, if I go, if I click here, he has no subs, guys. You can't even see how many subs he has. Are you seeing this, guys? You can't see how many subs this guy has. What is this? Alright, I just subscribed. If I get hacked, you guys know it's real. Just no. No. What? 
One of his friends has got million, five million subs. Oh, yeah, it's good. Hello, guys. I'm going to keep going with this. And um, just pay attention. I'm watching. I'm also watching your other video. Security breach. And I imagine with the chaos the world is in, YouTube hasn't been able to prevent it. So I don't even blame them for allowing this to happen. It needs to stop though, and quickly before the person responsible is able to cover up their tracks and build a legitimately successful channel from the ashes of all the people whose channels he's hacked Sorry. and turned into comment farms. YouTube needs to know about this and to stop it, but I don't have the influence to make them aware of it. And every day that passes, more people lose their channels to this incorrigible, reprehensible hacker. Therefore, I would really appreciate your support. After posting this video, I'm going to tweet it to YouTube. And the more exposure it gets, the better chance I think they'll see it. If you could share this video or retweet that tweet, I am definitely sharing this video, guys. You guys should do the same by please liking the video and share this video by sharing this video that I'm doing right now. I know it's confusing. Copy. Copied. Now, if I go on Discord, if I go on Discord and put it in my Discord right there, and then I'll put it in the Dragon Bros Discord. I'm just putting this everywhere, wherever I see it. He's just mad at you. Tell you why. Tell you why. And put this here. Guys, please leave a like and subscribe to the channel if you want this guy to stop. YouTube, I am praying for you to stop this man. Or bot, or whatever. Whoever the hell this guy is. Ban his accounts. And ban his bots. Because he's going to use... And he's going to use his bots like this. Mm. So YouTube, I am asking you with all my heart to stop this guy. If this keeps going, YouTube, then you're going to be ruined. No one's going to watch you. The only people are going to watch is this guy. Like and subscribe, guys. Please, I honestly need your help. Guys, we are at 300, 274 subs. I'm trying to reach 300. I will do a special video with my friends once they reach 300 subs. Please, guys, like and subscribe and follow me on Instagram. Good luck.